In a quiet fiber optic network running beneath a Tennessee city, scientists may have just cracked open the future of communication. For over 30 continuous hours, something extraordinary happened. Light, or rather, its quantum fingerprint, vanished in one place and instantly reappeared in another. No wires, no delays, just a silent quantum handshake between two particles made possible by one of the strangest forces in physics, entanglement. And this wasn't science fiction or an isolated lab test. It happened across a functioning, real-world internet connection. Researchers stabilized the connection with a clever technique that actively corrected environmental disturbances in real time. What they achieved might reshape how we send information, not just across cities, but across galaxies. From data security to space communication, it hints at a future where distance becomes meaningless and information moves without traditional limits. In this episode, we'll explore exactly what was done, why it matters for science and technology, and how it brings us closer to building a cosmic scale quantum network. The groundbreaking experiment came from a team at Oak Ridge National Laboratory, working with EPB of Chattanooga and the University of Tennessee. Their goal, achieve long-term, stable quantum teleportation using practical, real-world infrastructure. They succeeded, and then some. By creating pairs of entangled photons, the researchers used quantum mechanics to transfer the state of one photon to another located elsewhere. This process didn't involve physically moving the light, but rather copying its quantum state, its identity, instantly, regardless of distance. This is what scientists call quantum teleportation. But what sets this experiment apart is how it was done. Instead of using pristine, isolated lab setups, they employed standard commercial fiber optic cables, the same kind used for high-speed internet. That's where the innovation came in. To handle fluctuations in the environment, like temperature shifts or vibrations, they used Automatic Polarization Compensation, APC. This system continuously monitored and corrected the photon states, keeping the entanglement intact. Thanks to APC, they kept the connection stable for over 30 hours, setting a new record for sustained entanglement on real-world infrastructure. It wasn't just a test of the physics, it was a validation of feasibility. Quantum teleportation could now be integrated into everyday networks. This positions the technology to scale, making it a viable candidate for quantum communication systems, systems that use quantum principles to send information with incredible speed and privacy. Unlike classical signals, quantum information cannot be copied or intercepted without disrupting the system. That's a massive leap in both performance and security. Other groups, like those at Northwestern University, have achieved quantum teleportation over longer distances. But this ORNL achievement showed it can be done consistently, passively, and on public networks. The implications extend beyond the experiment, it's about readiness for the next phase. With that, quantum teleportation takes a step out of the lab and into the infrastructure we already rely on. So why does this matter beyond the physics lab? Because this technology fundamentally redefines how we can think about communication, security, and even time itself. Let's start with security. In a world increasingly concerned with data breaches and surveillance, Quantum communication offers a system that's virtually unhackable. Thanks to the fragile nature of quantum states, any attempt to eavesdrop would automatically destroy the data. It's not just encryption, it's enforced by physics itself. But the implications stretch even further. This experiment is a direct challenge to our classical understanding of information transfer. In traditional systems, information has to travel through cables, waves, or radio signals. In quantum teleportation, no such transfer occurs. The quantum state simply appears in a new location through entanglement. It's instant. There's no in-between. That defies how we've always thought about speed limits in physics, particularly Einstein's limit on how fast information can travel. 
Even though quantum teleportation doesn't transmit usable data faster than light in the classical sense, it forces us to reconsider what distance and communication really mean. And while this single experiment didn't leap across space, it lays the foundation for doing exactly that. If we can sustain entanglement over hours in noisy, unpredictable environments, what's stopping us from trying it in space? Already, nations like China are launching quantum communication satellites, such as MISIUS, which has performed quantum key distribution from orbit. The techniques used in this ORNL experiment, particularly the stabilization methods, could be applied to future space-based quantum networks, allowing us to scale up to truly planetary or interplanetary communication. Even more exciting is the intersection with quantum computing. Today, one of the biggest limitations in building large-scale quantum systems is moving information between parts of the machine without error. With stable quantum teleportation, we could design distributed quantum systems where processors exchange information instantly and reliably. What ORNL's experiment does is confirm that teleporting quantum states on Earth over long periods using real tools is no longer just possible, it's practical. It reframes our technological future in ways we're only starting to grasp. Now that quantum teleportation has been proven stable over time and infrastructure, the question becomes, what's next? The immediate applications lie in quantum internet development. Multiple countries are racing to build large-scale quantum networks that span cities and regions. With this new evidence that entangled photons can be reliably managed, those ambitions just became a lot more realistic. But perhaps the most captivating future lies beyond Earth. Imagine deploying half of an entangled photon pair on a spacecraft headed for another star system, like Proxima Centauri. If that entanglement could be preserved, it opens the theoretical door to interstellar quantum communication the ability to exchange information instantly, despite enormous distances. Of course, we're not there yet. Challenges like photon loss, decoherence, and the difficulty of distributing entangled particles across astronomical distances still remain. But the physics isn't the problem anymore. It's the engineering. And that's a field that advances fast once the groundwork is in place. This breakthrough also feeds directly into other high-level research. Some physicists now believe that entanglement might be tied to the structure of space-time itself, potentially offering clues about gravity, black holes, or even wormholes. In that context, experiments like this don't just impact technology. They may help us understand the deep architecture of the universe. Meanwhile, efforts continue in photon source engineering building more compact and precise devices to generate and manage entangled particles. There are startups working on quantum repeaters to help scale communication over thousands of kilometers and research into quantum memories that can store entangled states for long periods. As all of these pieces come together, we're witnessing the emergence of a completely new layer of infrastructure, one that operates not through classical bits and signals, but through entangled states and non-local interactions. It's not just the Internet 2.0. It's the blueprint for a galactic nervous system capable of transmitting information faster, safer, and farther than ever imagined. Quantum teleportation isn't just real. It's now reliable. And that changes the conversation about everything from cybersecurity to space travel to physics itself. Teleporting light used to be a fantasy. Now it's a functional, measured, and repeatable experiment. By maintaining entangled photon states across a live fiber optic network for more than 30 hours, scientists at Oak Ridge didn't just prove quantum teleportation works. They showed it can work consistently in the real world and with existing technology. From unbreakable encryption to the dream of instant communication with distant worlds, this achievement breaks boundaries, scientific, technical, and conceptual. We're entering a time when information won't just travel, it will appear, securely, instantly, and across distances we used to call impossible. The future isn't just connected, it's entangled.